Hey guys hello and welcome and without wasting much time let's get started. Today I will show you how to fix a rather big problem in Yuzu while playing Pokemon Sword and Shield. Right now as you can see, the game is running totally fine but, the problem is when you press the Y button. This button is supposed to open the YCOM menu. For those who don't know, YCOM is a new feature introduced in Pokemon Sword and Shield where you can trade or battle with others. Definitely you cannot do this in Yuzu as Yuzu do not support online play right now. And when you press this button in Yuzu while playing Pokemon Sword and Shield, you get this error message. And if you press OK, you will find that the game has stopped working. It crashes and you lose all your progress from the last save. No matter if you try to pause and continue the emulation, it will not run again until you relaunch the game from the last save file. Anybody would say you not to press the Y button, but no one wants to lose progress if it was pressed by mistake. One of my viewers asked me on how to fix this problem. So, I made this video. But there is a fix for this. You will not be able to use the YCOM feature with this but at least the crash will not happen and you will not lose any progress. Before starting, please subscribe to my channel to help me help you. First of all press the Yuzu mod page link in description that will open this page. In this page, scroll down until you find Pokemon Sword or Shield, for whichever you want this fix. Here are many useful mods for the popular Switch games, but I will cover only this one, the WiFi Crash Workaround. Click on this link for the game you want it. I am doing this for Sword. If you want this for Shield it is here. Click it and the download will start. I downloaded it for Sword, you should download it for the game you want. Once the download is done, close the browser. Then open this PC. Here click on Downloads. You will find the downloaded file here. Right click it and extract it here. Inside this folder, there should be another folder named exifs, and inside exifs, there should be these files. If it's like this for you, then it's correct. Now go back and cut this folder from here. Close this window and open Yuzu. Now right click on the game for which you downloaded it and then click, open mod data location. A folder opens. Right click here and then click paste. That folder will be moved to here. Check that it has exifs inside it and inside exifs, it should have these files. If it's like this, close this window and then close Yuzu and reopen Yuzu to load this mod. Now if you right click the game for which you applied it, and then click properties, under add on tab in the patch name column, you will find this new entry. You can enable or disable it from here. Keep it enabled and press OK. Now run the game. Wait for it to start. Now it's loaded and if you press Y button, it does not crash. The YCOM menu tries to open and then closes without crashing. That's the fix and now you won't lose any progress if you press that Y button. Thanks for watching. Like it if it helped and don't forget to subscribe. Share this with others and post any of your tech queries in comments.